Ever wonder which river in India stretches the furthest? Or perhaps, which one pours the most water into the surrounding landscapes? Well, today is your lucky day, as we are about to embark on a journey to discover the top 5 largest rivers in India. So, sit back, relax, and let the river flow. Starting our countdown at number 5, we have the Yamuna River. Originating from the Yamunotri Glacier at the Bandapunch Peak in the state of Uttarakhand, this river travels a remarkable 1,375 kilometers before it merges with the Ganges at Triveni Sangam in Allahabad. The Yamuna is not just a river, it's an integral part of the culture and spirituality of India, often referenced in folklore and mythology. Sliding into the fourth spot is the Godavari River. Also known as Dakshin Ganga, the Godavari is the second longest river in India, stretching an impressive 1,465 kilometers. It originates from Trimbakeshwar, Maharashtra, and flows eastwards into the Bay of Bengal. The river is a lifeline for millions, providing water for drinking, irrigation, and industrial use in several Indian states. Our third largest river, the Krishna, springs from the western Ghats near Mahabaleshwar in Maharashtra. Traveling a distance of around 1,400 kilometers, it eventually drains into the Bay of Bengal. The river is a crucial water source for four Indian states and is known for its fertile delta region, which is a major contributor to India's agricultural industry. Coming in at number two, we have the Brahmaputra River. Originating from the Angsi Glacier in Tibet, it flows through China, India and Bangladesh, covering a distance of nearly 2,900 kilometers in India alone. Known for its fierce monsoon currents and catastrophic floods, the Brahmaputra is a river of extremes. Despite this, it is a vital source of irrigation and transportation and its basin is home to diverse wildlife. And finally, taking the top spot in our countdown, we have the mighty Ganges. The Ganges, often personified as Goddess Ganga in Hinduism, originates from the Gangotri Glacier in Uttarakhand. It travels a staggering 2,525 kilometers coursing through several states before emptying into the Bay of Bengal. Beyond its physical magnitude, the Ganges holds immense spiritual, cultural and economic importance for the people of India. Its waters are believed to cleanse sins and its basin is one of the most densely populated regions in the world. Each of these rivers, with their own unique journey and significance, weave a rich tapestry of culture, history and life. They are more than just bodies of water, they are the veins that pulse with the lifeblood of India. So next time you find yourself by the banks of one of these rivers, take a moment to appreciate the vast journey it has made and the lives it touches every day.